I know several people who love the taste of asparagus, but they're not the only ones. The asparagus beetle also loves these tasty vegetables. Right down here, you can see we've got some asparagus beetles feeding on the spears here. There are these little tan, black, and orange beetles. They're not very large, about the size of your fingernail. They don't do a lot of damage, but they can do some. They feed on the spears. They cause scarring and browning. And another annoying thing they do is that they lay their eggs on the tips of the spears or near the tips. You can see right here we've got a number of the asparagus beetle eggs They're just kind of glued or stuck into the side of the spear. You can control the asparagus beetle with an insecticide like Seven or something that contains pyrethrin, but you need to be sure and read the label to see how long you have to wait before you harvest. Another way to keep down the numbers of the asparagus beetle is to harvest more often. This time of the year, we need to be harvesting our asparagus about every other day. And by doing this, it sort of limits the time they have to find the spears and lay the eggs. Another thing that uh, we can do to reduce their numbers is to not let any of the plants make ferns because the beetles and their larvae really enjoy feeding on the leaves. Right here you can see a little seedling of an asparagus plant and there's a little larvae, little gray larvae feeding, feeding on the leaves. And there's also a few asparagus beetle eggs up in there. So by, by keeping these pulled out of the garden, we can reduce their numbers as well. So unless eating insect eggs is appealing to you, next time you snap off a fresh spear of asparagus, you might want to check it for the eggs of the asparagus beetle. <laughs>